honey. Hey, baby. <laughs> mm. So, what do you want to tell me? You just got here. At mm -hmm. least a drink for you first, my fair lady. Take it, come on. A drink? Yes, a drink. Come Thank on, you. Here. You walk. You're acting really strange. Strange how? <laughs> first you offered me a drink. Uh-huh. And now you're staring at me. Staring at you how? Just like that. Tell me, Charles, what are you up to? Listen, I'm not up to anything. I just want to, just want to pour your drink. I mean, I always pour your drink, don't I? No, you don't. Mm -hmm. The last time you offered me a drink was the first time I visited. And that was three years ago. Mm -hmm. And since then, you just tell me, oh, baby, this is your house. Just take anything you want. And now you're offering me a drink. Charles. Okay? <laughs> you know I'm not lying, right? Whatever. Hmm. Hmm. You like it? Mm -hmm. Keep drinking. <laughs> Baby, Charles. three years ago, I met the most beautiful woman, the most amazing woman in the world. And now I want to make her mine. Will you marry me? Of course, yes. <clears throat> yes, yes. So we are engaged. <laughs> oh my goodness. Come here. Oh. We have to wait till our wedding night. Okay. I hope you're not angry. Um, I'm fine. I love you. I love you. beautiful in a very long time. Mm -hmm. Yes, you're right, honey. And that is because I am getting married. No way. <gasps> yeah, let me see. Wow, this is so beautiful. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank oh, he you. proposed. Yes, he did. Yesterday. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Congratulations, my love. Congratulations. Thank you. So tell Thank you me. So much. <clears throat> Have you guys done the... <clears throat> have we done what? Oh, Linda, you will never change. For your information, we haven't done it yet. Why? Why what? We are not married. And my baby understands that. Oh, please. This young man has proposed. Give him this thing now. <laughs> please, get behind me, Satan. Oh, now I'm Satan because I'm telling you the truth. Yes, you are. You want me to commit sin? No, thank you. <laughs> okay, no problem. But I'm happy to be in. I'm so happy for you. <laughs> thank you. Congratulations, man. Hey, thanks, bro. I'm so happy for you. Thank you. So, have you finally eaten the forbidden fruit? Mm -hmm. Well, she still insists that it will happen on our wedding night. She insists that it's on your wedding night. Yeah. Yep. What if you find out on your wedding night that she is not a virgin? Excuse you? Sorry, I'm not being a party pooper here. Like I said, just condition your mind so that if on the wedding night she is not a virgin, at least you will not be that shocked. Let me just ask you a question. Hmm. Do you like him? Um, love love her i mean like do you love her or mm. you just love the idea that she is a virgin well i love her that's good and i love the idea 
she's a virgin. Well, my friend, that is a wrong mindset, bruv. I'm not being a bad friend here. I'm just telling you. Do you condition your mind so that if she's not a virgin on your wedding night, you will not be that shocked? Dude, play. She's a virgin. I know. Play. Shoot. Okay. I said it. Yeah, okay. you said it. Right. You're definitely wrong. Right. That's okay. my ball, by the way. I, I put it that one. So oh, you're you going did? for the spots. Yeah. No, Rala. Baby, baby, you won't believe it. Do you know that my mom says she will invite the Achalugo cultural dance group to our wedding? <laughs> you know, my mom is just something else, honestly. <laughs> Babe? Hmm? Are you okay? Baby, talk to me. What is it? Well, then, I want you to tell me the truth. Are you still a virgin? Charles, how can you say a thing like that? I mean, we have been together for three years. Okay, fine. Do you want to put your hand in here to confirm? Go on. Is that what you want to do? Hey, 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 come, come. Come, listen. I'm sorry, okay? I just, I just don't want any surprises in that day, okay? It hurts that you don't trust me. No, babe, just come. I trust you. Good morning. Good morning. And how was your night? It's fine. I made you breakfast. Oh. Baby. What can I say? I'm a sweet kind of guy. That is so sweet of you. Uh huh. I know. Thank you. There you go. And. Ta da! Mm. You made this. I made it. So you mean this is for me? All for you. Thank you. You're welcome. Exactly what I needed. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah? Mm -hmm. Now that I know. <laughs> Thank you. You did it so well.
Hello, Mrs. Aquara. Oh my goodness. <laughs> How are Look at you. You already look different. Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, he stepped out. Ah, good, because I came here for big time. She's hi. This girl. <laughs> Thank yeah. you. Have a sit. Just me, just me, just me. Please, I want to hear it. Just you about what? Please, don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. Start talking. Hey, Belinda. <laughs> you will never change. Please, talk, Biko. Well... I enjoyed it. <laughs> but wait, listen. It was painful initially. At the end, it became very sweet. <laughs> <laughs> my friend, my friend. So, Congratulations. <laughs> I'm really, really happy for you. Now Thank I can you. officially say, welcome to the leagues of doings. <laughs> doings. Yes, now. Linda, what's that? Me, I don't know. I just said it. <laughs> You know, and you're a very crazy girl. I know, you don't have to tell me. <laughs> but I'm really happy for you. Thank you. You know what? Let us go inside and celebrate. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Now you're talking. Oh. It's all for puffing champagne. Ah, uh ah. -uh. I'm not here to joke. I'm not here to joke. <laughs> I am the most happy man in the world. Thanking you. Not only am I married to the most beautiful woman in the world, but I have finally tasted the forbidden fruit. Wow. Yes, and guess what? She was still a virgin. You ah. scored on that one. Yes! She was still brown. I tore up that nylon. <laughs> <laughs> man, you are a very lucky man to marry a virgin in this day and age. Uh-huh, and you think that you almost scattered that. What? Yes, you were putting all these crazy ideas in my head. Listen, I do apologize. Okay, uh -huh. I do take my words back. But man, listen, I was just trying to actually set your mind frame in a very particular place so that mm. if you go there and she wasn't a virgin, then you wouldn't be shocked. At the end of the day, it's me you come to and cry to. Okay? Apology she... accepted. It's fine. I got well, you. Man. Let's I got cheers you. to that. Let's cheers to that. You want me to walk all the way back there? Cheers to that? It doesn't matter. We can cheer. Then we play the game and I whoop your ass. <laughs> all right, then. Cheers to me marrying who? A virgin. Virgin. <sighs> All right, my beautiful family, heading out to work. No, honey, where are you going? I gotta go to work. I'm running late. No, it's not possible. You have to eat first. Please. All right, fine. Just a quick one. Um, a bite of this. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Wanna say something to me? Good morning. Good morning, my boy. <laughs> come here. Mm -hmm. All right, sweetie, come here. Mm -hmm. I'll All see right, you guys right. later, okay? Bye. Mm. Bye. Can you hurry up for your funnel cakes and drop them? My favorite young man. Come on, come on, say hello to daddy. Whoa! <laughs> How are you, champion? Okay. You're fine. How was school today? That's fine. That's good. How was work? How was work? Work was good. <laughs> so, what do you want me to prepare today? Oh my gosh! That must really be sumptuous because the way you shouted it, I am even, I am even looking forward to using it. All right? All right. All right. Ooh, ooh. Oh. Honey, you're welcome. Thanks, Judy. That was work. That was okay. Yay. Um, I was just going to freshen up and enjoy you guys for the fried rice and chicken. Okay. <laughs> All right, then. Junior. Um, Junior, pray for us. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Bless this food in Jesus' name. Amen. Now okay. you can eat your food. Let's eat then. Yeah.
it's really nice. <laughs> Mama, it's not me. Eh? It's not my fault that we haven't visited you. Yes. Mama is your son. Yes, Mama, he is. Okay, Mama. Yes. Honey. Mama. Hey. Mom. Uh, it's not like that now. It's just that I've been very busy. Don't worry, we'll come and see you soon. I will. Take care now. Thank you. Hmm. <laughs> like my mother, she can disturb for Africa. Mm. All mothers are like that. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? I am trying to pick a chap that will fit. Surprise you. Mama, you know that is not fair. Where's your bag? Ah, which bag? Don't get ahead of yourself. Her bag is in my house. And besides, she came to Lagos for me, not you. We are just here to visit. Mom, tell me he's lying. For peace to reign. Hmm? I planned to stay three months in Lagos. Mm -hmm. I will stay one month in Uche's house and spend two months in your house. What? How did that happen? Mom, come on now, that's not fair. I invited you to Lagos to come and stay with me. Now you want to spend just one month with me and two months with her men, that's cheating. Okay, mm. fine. I'll stay two months each with both of you. Mm, that's better. Look, you had better go and marry her. <laughs> better go and marry and leave my mother alone. Nah, you yes. don't have to worry. It's part of the reasons that I came to Lagos. Mm? Which you must show me his fiance. <laughs> This is a conspiracy, right? You guys are ganging up against me. No, I'm call it whatever you want to. <laughs> but you see this. Yeah. Uh -huh. You must marry. Bam. All Mama. Right. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. <laughs> uh, where is uh, Junior and your husband? Oh, Junior is not yet back from school yet. And my husband is still at work. Okay. But Mama, just relax, okay? Let me go get you something to eat. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I'm relaxing already. Oh, so you want to spend you want to spend two months here? When I was the one that invited you to Lagos, you guys want to find a coup. Just please leave me alone. Just get married. I need my daughter-in-law. I'm still too young. That's no rush. Too young. Who told you? Honey. Yeah. My mom and brother came by today. Really? Mm -hmm. Your mom is around. She's in Lagos. Yes. Okay. She arrived yesterday. She said she will spend two months with my brother. Mm -hmm. After which she will come spend two months with us. Ah, she's going to be spending some time with you, actually. With <laughs> us. <laughs> yeah, with us. Um, are you hungry? Oh, you know what I'm hungry for. <laughs> Where is the money? 
there is there, there, there's no money. For oh, you take my hair for just No, 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 no jokes. You, 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 can, you can take anything you want in the house. You say I... what thing? You send me message. No, 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 no. Oh, that fall out. I said, man, I go, come, come on, fall out I'm now. Coming. I'm coming, I'm coming. Like this. Okay, okay. Lion. Boss. Yes, sir, man. No, 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 no. And I was raped by the leader. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and the most painful part is that my husband accused me of mourning. <laughs> I don't understand. Why would you... Did you mourn? Of course not. Then why would he accuse you of such? He said I shouldn't have allowed the arm robber to touch me. He's a very stupid man to have said that. Is he not a man? Couldn't he have defended his wife? I don't know. Linda, I am so confused. I don't know what to do anymore. He doesn't even talk to me. I'm afraid that my marriage might be in jeopardy. This is really serious. <laughs> so scared. Men are just Unbelievable. It's okay. It's okay, my friend. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Don't you touch me. Come on, come on, fall out now. I'm coming, I'm coming. Like this. Okay, okay. Lion. Boss. No, 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 no,
Honey. Honey. Did you sleep in the sitting room? Hmm? Did you sleep here? Honey, did you sleep? Your daddy is not angry, okay? He's just hurrying to work. Eat, eat your food, yeah? Mr. Zos. Yes. Here are the test results. He is my son. Yeah. Thank God. Thank God. <laughs> Mr. Charles, were you suspecting your wife of infidelity in the first place? You would understand. I thank you very much for everything. Okay. It's alright. Alright. You can come by anytime. Sir. Sure. Thank you. Yeah. Have a nice day. You too. Get your hands off me. Get off me. Get off me! You slut. How could you? How could I what? How could you do this? How could you doubt that Junior is your son? I had to be sure. Sure of what exactly? Charles, you married me a virgin. Oh, Have you forgotten? Please. You think I don't know what you men do? Maybe you use something to tighten yourself down there. Huh? To deceive me that you're a virgin. I, I'm onto your tricks. 
Count yourself lucky that he is my son. I would have murdered you if he wasn't. You're very stupid to say that. I'm sorry, what did you say? <gasps> if you ever insult me in your life again, I will yank your tongue out of your face. He doesn't eat my food. He doesn't even touch me. He beats me up in every slight opportunity. And everything I do irritates him. Serious. I just found out that he conducted a DNA test on Junior. And when I confronted him, he beats me. No, no, Mona, this is, this is, listen, you can't continue to live your life like this, Mona. I, I suggest you, you divorce this man and move on with your life. I mean, this is too much. Linda, I can't divorce my husband because I love him so much. You know, I'm, I'm sure all this started after the attack. Maybe he's angry that another man touched me. Please, please, just stop giving this man excuses. Is it your fault that you were raped? I mean, if he didn't want any man to touch you, he should have protected you that night. He's just being stupid and I'm going to go and talk some senses into him. No. It will worsen the whole thing. Two worry, I'll fix it myself. Are you sure? Yes. I believe with time he would. He will come around. Well, I don't let this man kill you. Please. He won't kill me. Honestly, if you ask me, I will still say you should divorce this man. You don't deserve this. Linda, I can't divorce him. Because I love him so much. It's okay. <laughs> Charles, my guy. Buddy. Good to see you. Good to see you too. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good there. <laughs> and, um... Damn, I like those shoes. Thank you. I got them a few days ago. Oh, yeah? Yeah. How's it's your good. wife? Good. Good on you. Hello. Hello, our beautiful wife. How are you? I just asked after you. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. I'm good, thank you. And, uh, um, how's Junior? Oh, Junior is sleeping in his room. Oh, okay. Fine, thank you. Yeah, thank you. All right. My eyes. What is it? What is what? I just asked after your wife and he just kissed. No. Um. Um, honey, Mr. Charles, the dining is set. That's so very kind of you. My guy, listen, I'm so famous right now, so. Yeah, let's just go and eat outside. But your wife just served us food. And I don't want to eat poison. Let's go and eat outside. Come on. Let's go. Luna, I'm none the worse to whatever is happening here. But I promise to have a word with him, okay? I will have a word. I'm still trying to comprehend what happened earlier today. What is wrong with you? 
Why did you humiliate your wife like that, especially in my presence? She deserved it. Come on, man. You deformed my heart, sir. Is that what you can say? Trust me. You don't want to know. I do want to know, but obviously you don't want to talk about it. I mean, is it that bad? Bad? <laughs> bad is an understatement. What she did. So, what are you going to do about it? I haven't decided yet. Charles, listen. I can't take anything from you, but I won't have you disrespect me in front of your friend. I won't take that rubbish from you. Are you talking to me? Yes. Are you mad? Who the hell do you think you're talking to? at you. Mona, don't let this man kill you. He won't kill me. He's just angry with me. Charles has never raised his hand on me until that incident. I believe with time he would come around. <laughs> Are you even listening to yourself? Are you hearing yourself talk? You know, I can't even deal with this. I'm out of here. Where are you going to? Linda! Whatever your name is being called, you should be ashamed of yourself, you woman beater. How dare you? You walk into my office and you insult me. Oh, you haven't even seen anything yet. You stupid man with a, without a heart. Try it! Try it as if you will not spend the rest of your life in jail. You think I'm your wife? That you beat up anyhow and she keeps quiet because she stupidly loves you. Get out of my office right now. I'm not going anywhere until I'm done seeing what I came here to say. Your wife was raped right in front of you. And instead of you to show her love and pet her, what are you doing inflicting more pain on the poor woman? What kind of a man are you? Why did you not stop her since you're the macho man? Get out. Don't touch Get me! Out. Don't touch me! Get out! Don't touch me! Get out! Don't touch me! Stop it! Oh. Mona! What is it? Huh? Why are you shouting my name like that? So you sent your friend to come and insult me in my office. What are you talking about? Hmm? <gasps> I'm talking about you. Stop it! Stop! Stop hurting me! Stop it! Oh, you want to fight with me, right? I suspected that all was not well when he came here to run a DNA test. Yeah, you're right, Doctor. My friend has really gone through a lot in that house. But she just doesn't want to speak up. No, come on. Domestic violence is not something you hide. No. She has to speak up. If not, it will continue. This is just too much. This is too much. You know what, I'll, I'll just call up her family. Yes, you should. <laughs> Look at my daughter. So you mean that bastard did this to you? I swear to God, I'll teach him a lesson. 
stupid. Stop what? My friend, allow him go and deal with that stupid husband of yours. Huh? How dare you get your beauty hand for my sister? Your sister? Oh, she deserved it and more. Oh. If you ever lay your hands on my sister again, I'll kill you. Mom, I didn't know you were coming. Yes, I didn't. Charles, what am I hearing? I don't understand. Don't give me that pretense because you know exactly what I'm talking about. Mom, you just got here. Why don't you just go inside first? I mean, let me get you something to eat, you know, right? I'm not going anywhere with you. You put that innocent girl in the hospital and you expect me to come here and rest. No way. I'm going to the hospital right away. Well, don't expect me to follow you there because I'm not going. Son, what has come over you? Well, whatever this is, I'm going to fix it. I must fix it. Oh my God! Who? Oh, my daughter! I'm so sorry. My in-laws. I'm so sorry for what my son did. And there is no need to apologize for anything because when I am done with your son, you will all regret mine from this family. Come on, my in-law. It hasn't gotten to that. Oh, really? Take a look at my sister. It has. At least let's hear from them first. We can help them fix it. Remember, we are one family. Hmm? Let's give peace a chance to reign. Competition. Mona, what happened? Tell us how it all started. It all started when we were attacked by armed brothers and I was raped by their leader. What? You were raped? Yes, Mom. Hi. And since then, my husband developed hatred for me. Can you imagine that? Mom, did you hear what she just said? Charles! Charles, you're wicked! Charles, you're a very wicked man! Son, I'm highly disappointed in you. You mean your wife was raped? Instead of you to comfort her, you are there adding more pains. Do you know the trauma of being raped? Can everybody just shut up? <gasps> okay? For your information, this woman here was not raped. No. She shamelessly opened her legs for the arm robbers to take advantage of her. What? That is not true. Oh, they were guns. Did you fight back? No. Instead, you had the guy telling you that you enjoyed, and true to his words, you enjoyed, you, were, you, en you enjoyed it, you were even moaning! I wasn't moaning! But you Charles. enjoyed it! That's enough, Charles! How can you accuse your wife of such? Mom! You were not there, you did not see what I saw! I said you're a lunatic! And that's for you! I said you're insane! Uche, I don't have your time. As a matter of fact, I'm tired of all this. I want a divorce. You, you better lawyer up. Because I am taking custody of my child, there's no way I'm going to let a slut like you take half, half custody of my child. Oh, no, no, come, 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 come. Bring it on! Charles! Charles! You are not what is, you are nothing but an imbecile. Mona, stop crying. Stop, stop. Go up there, pack your things. Pack your things, let's leave here. Mona, chill. I am your mother. He does not deserve you. Let go and get your things. <laughs> Muna, 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 just stop crying. Don't waste your tears on that stupid, hopeless man you call a husband. He's not worth it. <laughs> Hi. Am I 
just lost my marriage of five years. About five good years. That's because I was raped. No, it wasn't because of the rape. It's because your husband is so <sighs> selfish and stupid. He's not man enough. So he doesn't deserve you. Listen, wipe your tears. Hmm? Don't cry. The man that will love and cherish you will come along. Thank God you're still young and still beautiful. I don't want any other man. I want my husband. Mona, my ex, Mona. my husband. I want. Mona. I don't want any other person. Mona, it's okay. Hmm? Mom is right. What he did is very wrong. He does not deserve you. Plus, he's not worth yes. it. Why yes. is it? Mona. It's fine. <laughs> Mona, please, please stop. Mona, do you want me to cry too? <laughs> yeah? It's yeah? okay. Do you want me to start crying with you? My son, I hope you know what you are doing. Mona is just a victim. Mom, she could have resisted, but instead she gave in so cheaply without a struggle. They were armed, and you said it yourself. If she had stood her ground, if she had refused, they would not have touched her. But instead, she opened her legs so cheaply for them. Yeah? Because she wanted to sleep with other men. She was looking for an opportunity to cheat on me. And the golden opportunity presented itself. Stop saying that. But I know what I'm talking about. I know of people who have actually stood their ground. And nothing happened. But no, not my wife. I hope you will not regret this decision. I certainly will not regret because I can't stand her anymore. How will you cope with Junior? I will reschedule my activities. I hope you know what you're doing. I certainly know what I'm doing. Hold on. I have lost my marriage. I have lost my marriage. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Why is it that women are to be blamed for everything in this part of the world? Why? It's just a crazy <laughs> mentality that we all need to change. People need to understand that African women are human as well. We've got blood flowing in our veins and we're not <laughs> superhuman. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Chow, what is it that I'm hearing that you have divorced Mona? Yes, I have. Do you have a problem with that? You are very stupid to divorce a, a good woman like that. And if you had any sense, you asked me why I divorced my wife instead of walking in here without knocking. You've been asking you constantly what the problem is and you have refused to tell me what it is. That is because what she did was so disgusting and despicable. What at all did she do that is so unforgivable? who robbed, and the leader of the gang raped her. Is that all? What do you mean, is that all? She gave him without putting up a fight. Can you listen to yourself, Charles? You said it yourself. They were armed. How do you expect her to put up with a fight with someone with a gun? You weren't there. You don't know what happened. I mean, the miscreant even said that she would enjoy herself. And she just laid down there so cheaply opened her legs. And she, she was even, she was even moaning. Are you sure of what of you were Of course. Saying? I was there. Why would she do such a thing like that? I don't know. Maybe she was looking for an opportunity to cheat and she got her golden opportunity to do that. Wow. This is serious. Women are something else. Otaba, 
Who be that? Who they shout my name? Ah. Ah, Adam, no verse. What is it? You know if you enter. I cannot enter. Yes. Why? Ah. Oh, that's a man. I man not allow you to enter this house again. But I need to see my son. No verse. You know go fish here. Are you okay? Come open this gate for me. Ah. They send you. Tell them say you don't see me. Come on. Oh, oh, open this gate. Ustaba! Oh, She's not a good person. I was saying mom not a good person. Because she's not a good person. Okay? Alright. Mama well, always puts me. Your mom was pretending. Alright? I'll call him and get you to school. Come on. Yeah, that's true. But are you going to continue like this forever? Well, of course not. I will remarry someday. As a matter of fact, I'm actually seeing someone. Mm -hmm. Just taking it slow. Make sure I don't make a mistake again. You know. All right then. Ah. Well, see I'll see you tomorrow. Later. All right. Get up, mom. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Okay. Let me go get your son. I'm coming. Thank you. Hey, Kido. How are you? Doing? Okay. Had a good day? Yeah. Thank you very much for taking care of me. You're welcome. Thank you. Oh, very good. Excuse me, sir. Yes. I've been willing to ask what about your wife. You mean my ex? I'm sorry. It's okay. We'll just do an hour, okay? Mm -hmm. Thank you for taking care of me. Champion? Let's go. Say bye. Come through. Hello, my son. Rawr! How are you? Fine. You're fine. That's good. All right, Junior. Junior, I want you to meet your new mommy. No, she's not my mom. All right, Junior, don't be rude. <laughs> okay, she's your new mommy from no, now. No, she's not my mom. All right. All right, you just run along and go and play, okay? You will Hi, get guys. used to her. Hi, guys. I am in my fiance's house, and the house is so cute. Take a look. Um, and my fiance is such a cutie. Honey. Say hello to my fans. Don't be shy. Say hello. Hi. <laughs> Am I not the luckiest woman on earth? My fiancé is so cute. <laughs> I am, of course. <laughs> All right. I will be going upstairs now. And I will catch you guys later. Okay? Mwah. Bye. Honey, let's go. What the hell is that? Oh, my fans. I have to bring them up to speed. You know, I have to give them content. All speed. right. You need, you need to kind of tone it down. I got a kid in the house, you know, so... Okay. Alright, let me show you. The room. <laughs> All right. Yes. Jessica, wake up. What is it? I need to be preparing breakfast for me and preparing my son for school. You know I slept late last night. I'm very tired. That's because you were chatting through the night. Have you forgotten that we made love all through the night? That's a lie. We made love till 11 p.m. And then you stayed online till 3 o'clock in the morning. Look, I'm not interested in breakfast. 
just get my son to school. Can you do that? Thank you. By the time I'm done with that, your son will run away from this house. Why is this bread still here? Why are you not eating it? I can't eat without tea. You can't eat it without tea. See your head like tea. Come on, will you eat that bread? Eat it! Eat! Eat! You're waiting for tea. Come and drink tea now. Yeah, drink water. Yeah, let's go to school. Let's go. Let's go to school. Give me your hands. Let's go. I just can't. Look, I need to get my son by all means. My dear, even if you try to fight him for the custody of your son, he will lose because he paid your bride price in full. I know. So what do you want to do now? Yes. I think I know what to do. What is it? Wait. Miss Jane. Oh, a long time. Yes, it's been a long time. <laughs> Sit down, let me go. Thank you so much. Jane, <laughs> come here. Oh my goodness. How about you? Right? I miss you. I miss you. Miss Jen, thank you so much. Thank you so much for taking care of my son. You're welcome. Um, we'll be on our way now. Okay. Jenny, let's go. Hey, bye, -bye. bye. Come here, baby. Hi guys. How are you guys doing today? You know, sometimes you feel so beautiful and you want to showcase God's creation. <laughs> Just take a look at this beauty. Take a look at this beauty. Oh, I'm so sorry. My husband is calling me and I'll be back, okay? Bye. Hello, baby. Hey, how you doing? I'm fine, darling. How are you? I'm good. Have you picked up Junior? Oh, shh. No, no. You know what? Forget it. I'm sorry. Okay. Since he's going to pick Junior. Guys, I'm back. I'm really so sorry. I've me so many things. Pardon, Tom. Um, can I get my son? Your wife already took him. My wife? Which wife? Junior's mom, of course. You allowed her to take my son when I told you that she's no longer my wife. But, 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 but sir, she's the mother of your child. And, but, and you never told me not to allow her to take your son. You know what? Where is she? And who are you talking about? Your sister, of course. Where is she? <laughs> She's not here. Don't you dare lie to me. She's here with my son. Look, man. I haven't seen her for the past six months, okay? What? Then where is she? Wait, hold on a minute. If you don't know where she is, then what did you do with my sister? Huh? Get your hands off me. I didn't do anything with your sister. As a matter of fact, I know where she is. Where are you hiding Mona and my son? What are you doing in my house? Oh, you think I'm joking, right? You think I'm joking with you? What are you? What are you? What is wrong with you? What are you? Charles! What are you doing in there? What are you doing in my house? Where is my family? You have no right. 
I'm sorry, okay? I'm just anxious to find my family. Please, where are they? You're mad. You're very stupid to ask me that question. Get out of my house. Get out! Rubbish! Can you imagine? I've been, I've been worried about you. Did, did, did you see him? Babe, 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 you need to stop this. You've been drinking since yesterday and it's not good for your health. I understand your son is missing, but that's not the end of the world. Just that your stupid ex-wife ran, ran away with your son. But what she doesn't know is, he's a boy. And he would definitely come back okay for his father. So you need to stop drinking now. And come and have your food. You've not eaten since yesterday. I'm not hungry. I've made your favorite meal. I'm not hungry. That's not true. You're hungry because you've not eaten since. Look, let's look at it this way. If you continue behaving like this, you're hurting yourself. And that means she has won. But we need to start planning on how to have our own kids. Let's look at it this way. If we have four kids, and Junior returns home, that would be five children. She has nothing. You know you're right. Of course I am. So give me this, and come and eat that favorite meal of yours that I made. Okay? Okay. Come, let, let, let me help. I'll help you. I'll help you, okay? Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, baby. All right. <laughs> you know, we have to arrange things. Of course not. Okay. Hi girls, what's going on? I hope you're beautiful today. Okay, I have an advice for you. Don't let any man use you as a slave, all in the name of marriage. Remember, girls run the world and keep being beautiful. Oh, I'll see you guys later. My baby is back. I need to attend to them, okay? Bye. Hi, baby. Why is this place so messy? Oh, um, you know, Tired from cleaning and all, we need a help in this house. And what, may I ask, have you been doing all day? No, let me guess. You've been prancing around social media. You know what, I'm tired and I'm hungry. What do you make? There's no food. I'm sorry, excuse you? I just got my nails done and I can't cook with it. We can always order or eat out. Are you mad? You mean you've been in this house all day and you prepared nothing? Please stop it. I'm not your slave. You've not even paid my bride price and you're here shouting. But, I beg! Well, thank God I haven't paid your bride price. Charles? Charles? Hey, what is eating you up? Yeah, you won't understand. Come on. Talk to me. Jessica. It's Jessica. Jessica. How? She is driving me crazy. She won't cook, she won't clean. All she does is Snapchat and Instagram every day, all day long. Are you serious? I'm telling you, man. Wow. Thank goodness that you haven't paid a bride price just yet. And if you have any sense, you will read the writing on the wall and flee as fast as you can before it's too late. No, you're right. Yeah, I'm fed with my behavior. Anyway, I'm here for the document. What? The land document. I forgot. <laughs> 
You see, she's driving me crazy. She's driving me crazy. The boss needs it. I just go and get it. Why don't you call her to bring it over? Hell no. I don't trust her with my dog. I'll talk to you later. Baby? Hi, baby. <gasps> Hi, baby. Mm -hmm. I thought you were not going to come. Come on now. I wouldn't miss your body for anything in this world. All right. Come give me some sugar. You know I got you. <laughs> that was awesome. You are a horse. I know you liked it. Haha. Where did they get this your energy from? From you, of course. I want another one. And another really? one. And another one. Oh. And another one. Really? Uh, no, not have that much. one. <laughs> My house, I'm you. sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, baby. Is it is the hand of the Who's I'm your sorry. baby? You cheap slut! You see? Don't you ever in your life call me names. Don't you ever try it! Leave what my, rubbish! Leave my house before I beat you blue black! <laughs> Get out of my house! <laughs> you see? <laughs> try it. No, no, try it and see if I will not call area boys to beat you. Because you feel you're tall and all that. No, try him now. Try him. What's up? Why do they worry you? Because say you What's up? Come here. No, try it. You think it's by height? The fact that you tall, not me say if he fight. Even with your height, we go bite you. Try him. Because I dare you. Get that thing that's thrown out of this, out of this compound. Come. come. If you come, if you touch this bag, Nami Waka come here, Nami go carry this bag, come here. What about? If you touch my bag. You want to lose your job? No, sir. Then throw out of this place. Wait, 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 wait. I go, go, sir. You see that boy, Donald? That boy is twice the man you can ever be. He gives it to me very well. So because say you tall, you feel say <laughs> you're man enough. You cannot do nothing. Come on, oh, carry your stupid this, this one, come on, this one now. I beg you. I cannot come on. Ah, my friend. Come on. What is happening to you? You do look a total mess. Hey, Kun. I shouldn't have divorced my wife. I agree with you on that. I allowed my jealousy get the best of me because I couldn't bear to see her with another man. And now she's gone and my son is gone with her. Hold on. You did insinuate that she was enjoying it. In fact, you said she was moaning. She, she was moaning. I just exaggerated because I was angry and I felt that she could have resisted the miscreant. Can you just listen to yourself? How can you be angry? You were there. They were armed. How would you expect Moona to fight back and resist him? I guess I was just so stupid. I of course you were stupid and a foolhardy at that. How you let a good girl like that go is beyond my comprehension. Victor, please, you gotta help me. You gotta help me get them back. I'm begging you in the name of God. It's okay, man. I promise I'll help you find them. Okay? I'll help you find them. Okay, just. my house. Uh, can, we, can we come in and talk? No, you cannot come in and talk because you're not welcome in my house. Linda, I totally do get it. You're upset for the right reasons, but please do hear us out. 
I'm only doing this because of you, Victor. Thank you very much. So what do you want? Please. I need to see my son and my wife. Excuse you? Your wife? The last time I checked, she's no longer your wife, so why are you calling her your wife now? No, no, look, I made a mistake and I want her back. You want her back? You divorced her a year ago, remember? And you think you can just come out from nowhere and want her back? What if she's already married? Fabi, come on, let me stop that. Are you even listening to yourself? You almost killed your wife because she was raped in front of you! And then you accuse her of enjoying it. What kind of a mom are you? You also know had the Godswing accuse her of infidelity. When you and I know you married her a virgin. I am sorry. I made a mistake. I was just jealous that another man touched her. You sound ridiculous and stupid right now. I have come back to my senses. Please just help me find her. Let me write the things I've done to her. I'm sorry to disappoint you. I don't know where she is. Oh, come on, help me in the name of God. Don't come close to me. Linda. Everything you've said right here is absolutely right. And understand why you are angry. You have every right to be angry. And I know that what my friend here did to your friend is wrong. He misses his family and I'm not making any excuses for him whatsoever. But his life is in a mess. He's going through a lot right now, so please help him get his family back. She also went through a lot. I know, and I understand that. But I'm just pleading with you. He's a mess right now. He's come back to his senses. Just help us find her. Please? Okay, fine. Thank you. But not today. When? Maybe tomorrow. Okay. Because where she is, is far away from here. Right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Just leave my house. All right. We will go, but we'll see you in the morning. Okay, thank you. Where's Junior? Oh, he's in the room sleeping. Oh. <laughs> Sit down. Thank you. <clears throat> I like your hair. It's beautiful. <laughs> Thank you, love. Um, Mona, mm -hmm. some people are here to see you. People? Who are they? Hello, Mona. What are they doing in my house? Listen, just... Listen to what they have to say, okay? Look, I do not wish to see him. Just get out! Get out! Muna, please. I do understand how you feel, but please do calm down. Don't you dare tell me to calm down. Because you don't understand how I feel. Muna, I know I did a terrible thing to you and I don't deserve your forgiveness. But give me a chance. I am never coming to the house. Please. Please. Never. Please, baby. Please, give us another chance. I beg you, please forgive me. Charles, there is no us. You divorced me. I will marry you again. Did you just say marry? Charles, have you forgotten the humiliation? The torture you put me through? had the mind of denying me from seeing my own son. I am so sorry. Sorry cannot wipe away all the painful memories you cost me. So what am I supposed to do with that? You're sorry. Just leave my house. Get out! She's gone. Leave my house! Get out! It's okay. It's okay. I'm really sorry I brought them here. I just thought you were going to accept him back. You don't know what I passed through in that house. 
I saw hell. I'm sorry. I just felt like it would be the best decision for you too. But, but I'm sorry. I can't go back to him. I can't. It's fine. Just can't. It's fine. But I want you to know that whatever decision you take, I am strongly behind you, okay? I'll always be here. My son, are you okay? Why are you here, Daddy? Um, why do you ask? I'm sure, Daddy. Your daddy traveled. Don't worry, you'll see your daddy soon, okay? It's late. You should go to bed. Right. Hmm? You need to be sleeping by now. Let's go. you want? I came to see you and my son. I missed you guys. I, I, I got this for my son and I took this for you. Thank you. But we don't need it. Come on. I, I know I did the most horrendous things to you, but I'm begging you, please, give me a second chance. Take me back. I still love you so much. Really? Yes. What about your fiancé? I have broken up with her. It's you I love. is you I want to be Don't with. you love. dare tell me about love, Charles. You don't love me. You know nothing about love. You humiliated me. You almost killed me. And here you are telling me about love. And I am so sorry. Get out. Please. Let me make it up. I said get out. Get out. Go. I, I, I don't want to see you. And... Take this with you. Take it. Please keep this nice. I said we don't need it. Can't continue to live like this. I lost my family. You have not lost your family. Okay? Just be strong, stay strong. You will get them back. You know what I think? Perhaps you should just um, involve both of your parents. They might be able to help. See, just cheer up. We'll get there, okay?
son, I warned you, didn't I? But you wouldn't listen. Look at what you've brought to yourself. How can you accuse your wife of such? Do you know the trauma of being raped? Mom, I called you to help me get my family back, not give me a lecture. You should have listened to me. Now you've allowed a good woman to go. And I said, I'm sorry. Please, just help me get my wife back. I miss my son. I miss my wife. You've divorced her already. What we should be talking about now is how to get your son back. Mom, I, I want my wife back. I can't live without her. Charles, see your life. Please, help me get my family back. I'm begging you. Sorry for all the wrong I did you. It's okay. I have forgiven you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I have missed you. Come here, Jenny. Still sleeping. This time of the day. Are you still sleeping? Oh, it's all a dream. I look so real. You better wake up and get dressed. You know we are going to meet our parents today. Yeah. Get up and get dressed so that we'll go. Please, my in-law, hear us out. Oh. <laughs> the last time I checked, we are no longer in-laws. So, what are you talking about? Please. Mom, I am so, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry for all that I have done. Sorry for what? Are you sorry for the humiliations or for the beatings that you gave to my precious daughter. I'm sorry, please. Ah, Charles, you are a very wicked man. You are a beast. How could you accuse your wife of such? Do you have the slightest idea of the pains of being raped? Do you? I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. I was just hurt that another man had touched my wife. <laughs> Can you hear yourself? Were you not there? Why couldn't you defend her? Since you don't want another man to touch your wife. Why didn't you defend her? You're a very foolish man. Just get out of this house. Hey, did you not hear what she said? Leave! Please, my in-law. Hey, 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 hey! I am not your in-law. I'm not your in-law. I am not your in-law. I'm sorry, I understand how you feel. We are both mothers, and if I'm in your shoes, I'll feel the same way. Please forgive him. Please. He has come back to his senses, and he has realized his mistake. Please, for the sake of our grandchild, please hug up. What? <laughs> it's not in my position to do the forgiving. My daughter is the one that will do the forgiving. How are you? I'm not fine. My daughter. Please forgive my son. He's really sorry. He really needs you guys back. Mama, you don't know what I passed through in that house. I understand you perfectly well. I do. Watch. Please. Find a place in your heart to forgive. If not for anything, for the sake of your son. 
He really needs his father, you know. But Mama, we are doing just fine without him. We are perfectly okay. And besides, Charles will never forget that night. He will still punish me for it. Mona, I swear on my life, I will never put you through anything like that again. I want to put this experience behind us and move on with my family, you and Junior. You are my life. You guys are my life. I am empty without you guys. Mona, you please. I beg you, forgive me. You know, no matter how much I try to hate you, the truth remains that I still love you. And, and I love you too, and I promise I will not put you through anything like this again. I am so sorry. Once again, I ask you to be my wife, to love and to cherish forever and ever, till death do us. To success, mm -hmm. to happiness, mm -hmm. and most of all, to a peaceful home. Yes. <laughs> Cheers. 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 Congratulations, Cheers. 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 Cheers